I woke up early, got dressed, packed my things, and left because I had a train to catch. Today is a travel day, heading down to DC for my sister's wedding. Very excited. On the way to DC, just got coffee, feeling pretty good. About to reach Philadelphia soon. Um, so far, a nice train ride. I love train rides, and this one was pleasant. I got to enjoy a cup of coffee and a croissant while doing a bit of reading. There was an ample amount of leg room, and the seat was comfy. I give the ride a thumbs up. Made it to DC. It sure has been a while. Um, my parents are here. I'm not sure where they are yet, but uh, I'm just gonna head to the hotel, go on a little adventure. On my way to the hotel, my parents are already there. Sarah and Henry are heading there. Um, don't know how long it will take. Lots of stuff to take pictures of along the way, so we'll see how it goes. I also find it kind of unfortunate that I moved in yesterday and then I'm already traveling today. I found the hotel. Hey Sarah. <laughs> What's up Henry? <laughs> After meeting up with everyone, we went to lunch at one of our favorite DC spots, Bobby's Burger Palace. I got the burger of the month. It was the nacho burger with tomato chipotle salsa, queso sauce, pickled jalapeno, and blue corn tortillas. It was a messy sandwich, but good. I also appreciate any burger restaurant that asks how you prefer your burger to be prepared. My burger was a nice medium rare. With lunch over, it was time for a bit of sightseeing. We went to the National Air and Space Museum. Now, I know one of the four NASA space shuttles was in the DC area, and I assumed it would be at this museum. I was only half correct. The shuttle is actually located in a companion facility in Chantilly, Virginia. However, the DC Museum is still an incredible place showcasing amazing vehicles and preserving some of the most important pieces of aviation and space history. Where do you want to go, Mom? What do you think, Sarah? Everyone got tired and decided to go back to the hotel, but not me. It's a good old-fashioned solo mission now. Donuts and coffee were on my mind. I mean, they're always on my mind, but at this time in particular, I needed to satisfy my craving. I'm a little upset right now. I just walked like two miles and they sold out of donuts. I'm so upset I didn't even buy coffee for them. Despite this tragedy, there is a Pete's Coffee nearby where I got a shot of espresso. Uh, Pete's, I have coffee now. Uh, it's okay, espresso. Really upset about the donuts still. That, like, walked like two miles. Skip the botanical garden to go get a damn donut. And it happened. Very upset. Very upset I didn't get the reservation earlier today. Things have not been super great, but hopefully you can turn that around. So the room is 140. So it should be this way, I think. Nope, the other way. This is a long and confusing hotel room. Eventually, I found my room and later joined my parents for dinner. We went to the Hill Country Barbecue Market where I got the beef brisket and a side of mac and cheese. Both items were good, and for dessert, I got a really enjoyable pecan pie. After the meal, my parents went back to the hotel while I went on a nighttime exploration of the National Mall to do some sightseeing and get some photos. 
I've been there many times before, but despite this, it always impresses me. It's a beautiful part of the city with remarkable architecture that tells the story of some of the most important people and events in US history. However, I wasn't out too long. Tomorrow is gonna be a big day. After all, my sister was getting married.